This is the Tinner's Way, an ancient trackway in West Cornwall. It's been used for thousands of years by pilgrims journeying to holy sites or traders on their way to market. It's one of hundreds of historic tracks that used to be the highways of Britain. However, as our roads network evolved and new roads are built, some of these old ways have been forgotten. Some have been wrongly designated as footpaths, while others have disappeared completely from modern maps. But the public's right to ride on them still exists. It hasn't been erased because they've been marked incorrectly on the map. And these ancient routes, which used to be used by horses and carts, could form crucial links in our fragmented rights of way network. Right now, only 22% of the network in England is open to cyclists and horse riders, and routes often don't link up. Sometimes they just change from a bridleway to a footpath for no obvious reason. The problem is that even if applications are made to restore these lost ways to their rightful status, confirming them is a long process. Most councils have a backlog that could take up to 15 years to clear. When it takes so long to correct past errors, it's clear our rights of way system just isn't working. It's just not practical to wait 15 years for a label to be changed on a route that has a clear historic precedent. That's why we've included some of these sections, like the Tinner's Way, on our new trail, the West Kerno Way. Making it easier for people to get out on a bike and be active would have huge benefits, both for public health and for the rural tourism economy. But right now, we're missing the opportunities that already exist on the ground. And there's real urgency to this, because after the deadline of 2026, no more Lost Ways applications will be considered by councils. It's clear we need to simplify the system for upgrading rights of way. If you want to get involved with improving off-road access for cycling in your area, have a look at the campaigning resources on our website and join Cycling UK to strengthen our voice. Together, we can make a better world by bike.